Right, okay guys, back with another uh, Game Boy series video, and this is going to be Speedball 2. Now, this is a game I have played in the past on the Amiga, and also the Mega Drive, I believe. Never played it on the Game Boy, though, so this could be interesting. I'd like to think it'll play quite well. It's a fairly simple game, to be honest, so let's have a look. But knowing the Game Boy, it'll probably be hard. Right. Okay, what do we want here? Yeah, I'll go for knockout. Oh, so you still have to buy stuff in that like you did before. Right, here we go. And we got the ball. Oh, we've been fouled already. Oh, I think I had the ball then and I accidentally threw it. Right, so because you haven't got the colours thing, they've done it so that they're just lighter. What happened there? Yeah, it's actually quite difficult to play actually on this. Oh, my goalie moved. <laughs> I don't believe it. I was trying to get control of the defender, and for some reason it switched to the goalie. Yeah, I've got to be honest, this game doesn't seem to translate too well to the Game Boy, I've got to be honest here. It's a bit sketchy. Oh, man, just getting near the goal is going to be a challenge here. Yeah. Go pass it in the other guy. There we go. No, I did not mean to throw it down there. Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> I was just about to take a shot in as well. Goalie failed me. Oh, this is not going my way here at all. You used to be able to stretch your arm up, I think, and grab it. Yeah, this version of it, it's not great because it's the Game Boy and it's obviously more limited than a Mega Drive or Amiga. You quite often find when you push the button, it, there's a slight delay. So you might find that it doesn't quite do it when you want it to do it and by then it goes to the wrong person. All right, we want to try and get that goal. Right, come on guys, stick with me. Gotta take that goalie out. Oh, too high. Because you what you gotta do, you gotta tap it very slightly to keep it low, and if you hit it too What happened now? If you hit it uh it's half time. If you push it too hard for too long, it throws it up in the air rather than straight. Oh, man. Yeah, this is challenging. See, I would have played this in my Mega Drive series, but there's an issue with it. It doesn't run properly. So, I couldn't really... Oh, man, how fluky was that? <laughs> this is not good. Losing here. Straight out, take him out if we can. Come on, guy, wake up. Get the ball, get the ball. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, like, you used to, on the Amiga and the Mega Drive version, you can slide in and tackle, which was fairly easy to do. But on this, it's not. <laughs> it doesn't really seem to do it quick enough. Yeah, and I've got another one. No way I'm going to pull this back now. It's funny because a lot of games quite often um, translate to the Game Boy quite well, but I would not say this is one of them. <laughs> so, let's get that down at me other guy. Come on, let's get it in that goal. 
It's not. So you notice how much quicker their guys are. Oh no! And we got one. <laughs> yeah, their guys are way quicker than mine. Oh, he's got the ball off me. No, not across the goal like that. Oh, the goal is run out. What's he doing? Get it, get it, get it. It doesn't seem to transfer to your other players quick enough. Like, that's another thing. See, on the Amiga, the minute you threw the ball to one of your other players, it automatically switched to that player. So, um, yeah, it sort of goes to the nearest one to the ball. But with this, it's, it doesn't seem to do it quite that quick. So, by the time it does do it, you've already been intercepted and they've got it. So, yeah. Um, I'll be honest, this I'm going to leave this one here, so it's going to be a short video. Because this is not a good version, I do not want to play it again. Um, like I say, the Amiga version and the Mega Drive versions were great. Um, unfortunately, there seems to be a problem with my Mega Drive version, so it's not one I can do, unfortunately. So this was the only version I sort of had access to, so that's what I went with. Anyway... I know it was short guys, but um, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, share and subscribe. And hit that little notification bell so that you're made aware of any future videos and live streams. And until next time, take care, stay safe. Nerdy Geezer out.